What's up guys and welcome back to the channel where I show you the best tweaks for your device. In today's video I'm gonna show you the best jailbreak tweaks to bring some iOS 14, 15 and iOS 16 features to older devices. These tweaks will make your device much better so you don't need to update your iOS device and lose the jailbreak. As always if you would like to stay up to date with the latest iOS jailbreak tweaks and jailbreak news of course don't forget to subscribe and make sure you turn on notifications so that you don't miss another episode. Alright the first tweak we have here is M Pro. M Pro is a must have jailbreak tweak that brings the modern in iOS 16 style lock screen time and widget features to older devices. This tweak offers enhanced customization options for both the lock screen and notification center, making it the ultimate tool for personalizing your lock screen on iOS 15 and below. If you love the iOS 16 lock screen but don't want to upgrade and lose your jailbreak, with this tweak you can get it for free. As you see, you can customize the lock lock screen widgets, customize the time, the colors, date, and more. It's a must-have tweak. The next tweak is Velux Reloaded. Apple on iOS 14 and newer introduced widgets on home screen. Now you can get widgets on your home screen with Velux Reloaded tweak. Velux Reloaded can spice up your home screen with widgets for any app. This tweak is efficient, created with non-battery draining in mind and will transform your home screen to something special. It's one of the best jailbreak tweaks to get widgets on older devices. There is also another tweak that gives you widgets on your home screen and this tweak is Zen HTML. Zen HTML can spice up your home screen with widgets as Velux Reloaded. You can get a lot of widgets with this tweak and of course you can download it from Cydia. The next tweak is Call Bar. Apple on iOS 14 change incoming call view. You can get this UI on your device with Call Bar XS tweak. Call bar redesigns the incoming call view to allow you to use your device while it's running or while in a call. The next tweak is Scorpion. Scorpion brings a beautifully reimagined incoming call interface to the iPhone, replacing the clunky full screen interface with a non-intrusive banner that lives at the top or the bottom of your display. The banner is fully customizable and includes all the buttons and shortcuts that you would come to expect from an iPhone's incoming call interface. It's an amazing tweak alternative to call bar tweak. The next week is small Siri. In iOS 14, Siri has been completely redesigned. If you hit the annoying Siri window that covers up the entire screen in old iOS versions, small Siri tweak reduces that window to the size of a notification banner at the top of your screen, allowing you to use your device for other things. The next week is Titan. In iOS 14 and newer, Apple introduced a picture-in-picture feature. With this tweak, you can get picture-in-picture -picture feature. Titan is a tweak that helps expand the number of apps with which you can use picture-in-picture -picture modes on your device. Picture-in-picture -picture mode allows you to watch videos from an app on your device in a smaller, separate window while doing some other things on the main window on your device. There is also another tweak that allows you to get picture-in-picture -picture feature with which is force in picture tweak. Force in picture tweak enables picture in picture mode on all unsupported devices as long as you are operating on iOS 9 up to iOS 13. It adds an option to play any video in picture in picture from the built in player. The next week is Evil Scheme. In iOS 14, you can change the default apps. With Evil Scheme tweak, you can change the default apps in old iOS versions. Evil Scheme enabling users to choose any third-party app as default app on their devices. With Evil Scheme tweak, users can select a different web browser as default on iPhone or iPad. Similarly, they can choose Google Maps as default maps instead of Apple Maps. Or you can choose Google Google Chrome and State of Safari. The next week is YouTube HD Unlocker. In iOS 14, you can watch high quality videos on YouTube. YouTube HD Unlocker is a tweak that shows and activates high resolution, 4K resolution, and high quality 60 frames in the YouTube app on devices that support this thing. This feature is present by default in the YouTube app, but it was hidden for several years until the jailbreak revealed it. The next week is Asteroid. 
Asteroid allows displaying live animations of the weather on the home screen or lock screen like iOS 14. Asteroid is impressed with modern features that are certain to catch users' eyes through use. For example, the tweak displays weather app inspired animations over the top of the home and lock screen wallpapers, such as raindrops while it's raining outside or snowfall when it's snowing outside. It's really good tweak. Okay guys, the last tweak we have here is boulders. Apple bring boulders tweak features to iOS 14. Boulders is a lightweight tweak designed to extend stock folders to the edge of every screen. Enjoy more apps per page. A quick count of the contents, all without friction in a smooth as talk interface. Alright, these tweaks will make your device much better and it will bring some iOS 14, 15 and iOS 16 features to old iPhones. So guys, this is our tweaks for today's video. As always, if you enjoyed watching this video, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel for more Jailbreak Tweaks videos. Hope to see you in the next videos and peace.